February 6th, 2016, Central New York. While some of us are out dirt fishing, others are out doing what they should be doing this time of year, ice fishing. Good luck to you guys out there on the ice. And hoping for some good luck here myself. I got a decent signal here, ranging 86 to 91, six inches down. Let's check it out. Rusty bottle cap. Better luck. Okay, three uh, pennies in. I get the first wheat of the day. Been here just a few minutes. I'm not sure if that's focusing or not. And I can't get a date off it. Um, but definitely a weedy. And uh, keep pushing on. Nah, that's funny. This here rang up like a silver dime. I was hopeful. TWA. Moving on. In case you're getting any ideas, there's no swimming in this area. Yeah, so far I've uh, been getting a pocket full of clad. Um, three wheats, so I'm just going to keep plugging away, maybe give it another hour. Hopefully find something good. out doing their Saturday thing. Some metal detecting, some ice fishing. Now I got a hockey game breaking out. Okay, I finished yesterday with um, five Wheaties, all from the 40s and 50s. That was the highlight of my Saturday. Um, Sunday, turns out the weather's even nicer yet. Can't believe there's people still on the ice. It's getting a little thin, but they're having fun. Hope they stay safe. Um, gonna give it another shot today. Hope I can uh, get some higher quality finds. I'm happy with the five wheats. I'm happy with a pocket full of uh, clad. Happy just to be out in February detecting still. But let's try to kick it up a notch today and find something more interesting. Okay, I headed away from the shoreline and up into the woods. And um, I, what I just dug, what is my first 
old school button. I always watch all these uh, YouTube movies and everybody's finding buttons. I don't really know much about them. I, it has a full shank. I can't see any kind of pattern. Looks to be about the size of a penny. So if there's any button experts out there that can give me any information, greatly appreciate it. My first old, what I would guess I would call colonial style button. Looks old. It was probably about eight to ten inches deep. Almost gave up on trying to find locate it, but persisted and this came out of the hole. Happy with that. Okay, from old colonial style button to partial motorcycle. Not that old. The search continues. Okay, I think I found the toy department. Shortly after the uh, motorcycle, found a car. Mercedes. Got excited over a 93 signal on the AT Pro. Just two quarters laying on top of each other. Little spill. We'll take it. I'm telling you, so far today, it has been quarter day. Um, I came out of the woods, and besides that uh, flat button and a couple of the toy cars, motorcycle and car, um, it's been nothing but clad. Book. Lots of quarters. I bet you I got five dollars worth at least. Killing it with quarters. So, on to the next. So beautiful out here today. We're going to do the wrap up right outdoors. Um, I did end up with uh, strictly clad as far as the coinage goes. Six dollars and twenty-five cents in quarters. Total of seven seventy-one. That was just um, Sunday's totals. And then I uh, had the two toy cars and uh, the button were all these things of interest, to me at least. A couple other little doohickeys there. Not sure what that is. So, on the board with the button. Full shank. Happy with that. That was, uh, I was in the woods to start the day, just briefly. Found the flat button, found a couple bullets, and then I uh, left the woods and started working my way back and uh, down towards the beach and uh, through some picnic areas, and that's where I found the toys and the uh, coinage. And then we'll call it a wrap. Thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.